Trolls and Ogre, or... Uh, no, you... That's only a god to do that. They wouldn't have turned into a weapon. Oh. What would they turn into? Like a frog? Uh... Well, there was really only one outcome for that, and you chose properly. It won't work, Anthony. I'm going to turn into a frog. I'm going to turn into a frog. Yeah, you are. Man, that would be insulting. Exactly. He's not going to beat me up. If I beat him as a troll, he's not going to beat me as a holy one.
like this. So the flap stays closed when you inhale, it sucks in. When you exhale, the flap opens and the air comes down out the bottom of the little slit. Right? Theoretically, I could put a straw in there and prop that little flap open <laughs> and have it reach right into my mouth. Without even opening your mouth. Without opening your mouth. Some kind of mosquito outfit with your respirator. I took down all the notes I thought I could be going over them last night and like listing them all off to him so we could go like file them and whatever. I noticed that there were no fifth level spells. Is that right? Yep. Okay, there we go. It's right. But I was like, man, did I miss a whole level's worth of spells from this spell book? How did I miss that? So, okay. There weren't any. Nope. Good, good, good. We are a small game shop, and they have been doing the best that they can to get through the pandemic, but if they can always use some help, and if you would feel so inclined, if you're watching on Twitch, you can scroll down, and you'll see a tile there for Help Save Go and Gaming. We have GoFundMe. Any little bit helps. If you value having game shops in your community, feel free to support them. There's also a tile for TNC, which is Talent and Club. We have a deal going with Talon & Claw that if you use code GOINGAMING in all capital letters on their Etsy store, you will receive 10% off your purchase. In turn, they kick 10% back to the store to aid them with the pandemic. Well, last week, we left off. You guys had fought some Nagas um, at the behest of a ghost. The, uh, who no was a, in life, was a priestess of mass, and you defeated those Nagas actually fairly easily. And uh, she has moved on to, as far as you know, she has moved on to her place in the afterlife. Um, on the... Um, the Slither Swamp level, and knowing that the next level down, uh, or assuming that the next level down there are uh, big bad mages, you go back to Troll's Hole Manor to uh, rest and recoup before continuing. <laughs> <laughs> I still remember the trap. Right by the cat tree. We'll, we'll go by the trap after we, yeah. when we go back down. The wizard trap? Yeah, with the logs. I was just looking at my little illustration here. When you climb up out of the the well in the yawning portal, um, you find that it is early morning. Wow, being underground really messes with your sense of time. Head straight for the Troll Skull Manor in the North Ward. And by the time you get through the North Ward towards Troll Skull Manor, there is a young 10 year old street urchin with a pile of, of papers in his arm. And he's yelling out, Read all about it! Read all about it! Get your broadsheet! And he hands out this. You can pass that around. Oh, yeah, that's what I mean. And for our viewers, I will take screenshots of the broadsheet and other handouts. And Some good information in that. I know kidnapping. That's what I got from that. 
kidnapping, 15 people missing in the last two months. The Council of Waterdeep is uh, concerned about the loss of 15 merchant ships. And uh, they think they're pirates from Luskin. Other people say, I don't really think so. Uh, they're 14. Luskin's trying to get into the Luskin Alliance.
adventurer in life. Yeah. He was just a, a commoner who was in love with his tower. Uh, and Liv now can speak. Yay! <laughs> and does he want to be friends with me? He most certainly. Hope that I've won him over as a good homie. Granted him a whole nother life. Usually does, but I mean, if you guys want to give Wait, it a shot instead. Technically, excuse my. Uh, you get a plus twenty. Plus twenty. I'm sorry. You get a plus thirty. It might be like just name whatever number you want. Ooh. <laughs> I don't think that's much of a twinge to her. <laughs> I got a 10. Oh, I'm sorry. Roll D100. It's percent. Oh, percent. Okay. Yeah. Why is there a fly? It was over here for a while. <laughs> Time for a guide me. That's <laughs> 98. Yeah, you did really well. Roll 60, 10 times 5. I don't have 6010. Roll me 6010 over there, Carl. 6010. You got a roller? 6010 and multiply it by 5. Mm. Uno, dos. Trace. I got just uh, hair How many? Average. Uh, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Anthony. You have to lucky roll. Sixty ten. Twelve. Thirty-seven. Only did the business cover its own maintenance costs and break even. You made two hundred and five gold pieces in profit. Nice. And your Twinga special blessing for this uh, game session is a new one that you have never received before. Ooh. It is Boon of the Stormborn for this game session. You have immunity to lightning and thunder damage. Maybe. Maybe it's possible, yes. It's also possible, no. And so. Lift, thanks, Lord.